You look concerned. I'm worried about Persephone. I haven't been here long, but I've already heard. People want her overthrown. You have? What do these humans expect from her? I'd heard some of the more ungrateful delinquents are planning to rise up. Imagine! These ungrateful delinquents. Could they be right? Bah! You give them too much credit. Still, Persephone needs protection. Don't look at me. There's a friend of mine and your father's, Kiros of Zarax. He's a strong and honorable warrior. He's been abducted, but if we could free him... You're suggesting we make a human Persephone's bodyguard? With Kiros at the ready. The humans will think twice before attacking one of their own. Say no more. I'll find Kiros for you. Ah, I knew I could trust you. While you're gone, I'll arrange a meeting with Persephone. Bring Kiros to the heart of Elysium. We'll be there. Kiros of Zarax? Hermes that sent me. Make is predictable. I'll give him that much. So, how do you get that stuff? Pythagoras was my father. <laughs> Things happened. Now it's mine. Ah, Off that right? Uh, that makes yeah. us family. I knew the man well. I heard it. This way. Persephone is waiting. Persephone herself? This is going to be easier than I thought! Wait. What's going to be easier? All right, Kiros. Let's make this quick. You said this is going to be easier than you thought. Since we're basically family, I'm trusting your honor. I work for Adonis. But you were caged by humans. Yes. And Hermes found out about it. Right around the time Persephone was coaxed into deciding she needs a bodyguard. You talk about honor? You set up this lie and use me as a mule to infiltrate Persephone's lair. I expected to meet a warrior. Before I met your father, I had four sons, each a warrior. When my third boy fell in battle, there was only guilt. I'd cried all my tears for the first two. Go on. And with the fourth, I felt longing. Sadness had become my only friend. And I had no one left to grieve. Warriors don't bring peace. They bring sorrow. Huh. So by getting behind Persephone's defenses, you think you can prevent war? Well, you could convince her to surrender, or distract her while Adonis escapes. Anything but battle. But before we go to Persephone, I have to send confirmation this plan worked. Will you take me? We've already wasted too much time talking, Kiros. We have to go. You're as stubborn as your father. Still, you mustn't say anything to Persephone. If she knew what we were doing, she'd have my head. I hear Persephone likes to test her new recruits. And I've got a bit of a temper. If you see me turning red... I'll think of something. <laughs> Ella! You've come back, and just in time. <laughs> ah! Kiros of Zarax, tell me, are you the obedient dog Irmis claims you are? I do love dogs. <laughs> Does he not speak? Oh, he speaks. Kiros, take a deep breath and speak. Apologies, my queen. To hear of your beauty is one thing, but to see it up close is another. Beautiful, am I? Ah, among other things. Here, child of Pythagoras. If he were here, he'd be proud of what you've become.
My queen. She touched me. Kiros is right, my friend. I knew your father well. If he were here, he'd be proud. Here. Keeper, I've been robbed. These are dark times for Elysium. Those delinquent fools have robbed even me. What did they take? I fashioned a key. A recipe, if you will, for an eternal flame. I intended to gift it to Persephone. With it, she could shine her light, even in the underworld. An eternal flame could bring order to this chaos. You understand her burden better than you let on. By enduring her sacrifice, Persephone keeps us safe in the underworld. So write the recipe again. What I wrote took lifetimes. We can't let it stay in the hands of humans who would use it against her. Keep her! Alexios, we have to steal it back. You're a good man for wanting to protect Persephone. I'll help. Ah, I thank you. You are quickly becoming my friend and ally. I'll find the rebels and get your recipe. That's all I ask. If you are spotted or cause a commotion, we risk retaliation. Go unseen. This looks like the scribbles of a madman. But it's been ripped. Hermes asked me to go unseen. We need to get the recipe back. About that. Here it is. You've spared this realm great suffering, my friend. I wonder, were you spotted? Of course not. But ah, Hermes... good. We don't risk retaliation. I'm giving these torn pieces back, Hermes. But I'm trusting you. A flame that never dies could consume all of Elysium. I swear to you as your friend. I will only use the flame if it's absolutely necessary. Hermes, things are worse in Elysium than I've been letting on. The rebels are organized and ready to fight. War is coming. We must crush the force behind the chaos. Let's fight for Persephone. You're so worried about Persephone. You can't even see you're in just as much danger. You kept the eternal flame out of the hands of the humans, and you went unseen. We have the upper hand. We just have to strike. Calm yourself, Hermes. It's not like you're going to go on a rampage. And why not? There are so-called captains guiding the human forces. They invited chaos into this realm, so let's show them chaos. Fine. I'll kill the captains. Thank you. You know, when you told me people wanted Persephone overthrown, I wondered if you were talking about yourself. I'm sure you did. I cannot let you do this alone, my friend. Let's fight side by side. 
All right. I've never fought alongside the god before. This should be messy. For eternity, Elysium has been a place of peace. If we do this, maybe peace will return. Maybe, but war has a way of following me wherever I go. Let's get out of here. It's been a long time since I had to use this blade, my friend. You're right. It felt good to fight with a friend. You're quite a warrior. But the war is just beginning. It is. Persephone needs to know what we've done. I'm going to her. If she rises to battle... Will you join us? One way or another. Until then, my friend. Hermes! You shouldn't be here. Where else would I be while the humans burn Elysium to the ground? My friend, help me protect her. I have helped you. But nothing is going to stop this. The gate must open. After everything I've done for you. Please, Hermes, listen to me. We haven't had the easiest friendship. The Staff Keeper and the Keymaker. But you've done so much for me. Together, we'll get Persephone to stand down. Oh, thank you. Let's go. Together. Stop! Pathetic! You failed me for the last time, Hermistris Megistus. Persephone's control over Elysium needs to end. Now! <laughs> <laughs> 